All right, so it's round one, game two. Ah, oh, geez. So we have two two drops, three drop, two three drops, four drop, and a five drop. We just need to draw like straight land in the order of either black or white, and then the other one. <laughs> eh. We can't keep this. We have to mulligan. Oh, my lord. Okay. We're keeping this one. I hope we draw black, because otherwise this is kind of awkward. But there's Rogue's Passage. How's that for... Oh, and Lava Crew. In the hopes that we draw black, we will play him. Or that. Him. The mountain. Him. This basic land. <laughs> All right, no two drop. That's a good thing. Well, we didn't draw what we needed to. So, whoops. Do that. The glorious beginning here. Could have punished his slow start. <laughs> had we had a black. All right, he's got something that will block everything I ever have all day long. Except that I have a Rogue's Passage. So it really won't. Um, I think the plan is to just get out the Lava Crew. Let's do it. Yeah. We know. You're playing the Defender game, but our Defenders do damage. It's kind of a good thing to have as a Defender. It's the ability to do damage. Even though you can't attack. And he's got nothing there, so that's good. Um, here... Jeez. Yeah, let's draw all of our things. We could ping him for two if we play our Spike Gesture, but I think we want to get the Hired Torture online now. Correct? So we'll make that black and white and red. This is, like, so funny. So we just need to play somewhat quickly to beat the clock. We are three minutes behind him. Yeah, you won't be attacking. But you could probably cause things to attack. Um, by putting counters on them. We're just drawing our land. Thank you. We like to draw land. Did you know that? So we can do three damage to him a turn now. Just period. Or do we develop the board with a Scorch Walker? I think we... That's a good question. I think we just pass it back. <laughs> We definitely have the three damage a turn going, and that's about it. I would like to draw a swamp, actually. If I'm going to draw lands, please draw me a swamp. Make things easier. Yeah, okay. Well, you still can't attack quite yet. If you do, I know something's up. Oh, yeah, you can attack now. Okay, okay, well, we're playing this, huh? Alright, so there we go. And he's got a trestle troll waiting to come out. Oh boy. Hmm. 
Well, I think we put down the Scorch Walker here. And we pretty much have to trade with that thing. Although it, he can't, no, he can't give a trample right now. And that's all we can do. Should we show him the Rogue's Passage? Possibly. Yeah, I think we have to. <clears throat> so if he plays another green creature, we're in trouble, because he can make it a 6-6. Six, six. But then I say we double block. I mean, we have to kill it. Yep, we knew that was coming. I mean, he has to make it an 8-8 eight eight to avoid our what we can do here. Uh, he might be able to. He's tapping that for 3 mana. I didn't realize I was drafting the defender deck when I did this. Okay. Well, that's not bad. I was expecting worse, actually. Three mana from that, plus one would be four. God knows what he could do then. What is he revealing? Jeez, he's revealed a lot. They just put a land card into it. Yeah. All right. He is attacking. Really? What does he have? Uh, what did he do to my guy last time? He returned it to hand. It was a charm. Blue, blue isn't going to do that. I think we have to take this. And if we block with everyone, we don't take any damage. Okay, we're doing that. It's a good old triple block. He's Scorch... No. That's my Scorch Walker. How's he ordering them? That is the question. Who does he want to kill? The torturer or the lava crew? Probably... I don't know. Which one's more annoying for him? First Scorch Walker, then the torturer. Yeah. And we'll just do that. Just to... Have done it. In case anything crazy happens. Alright. It's like a two for two. Deviant Glee and Denizen for Torture and Scorchwalker. Is what's happening unless tricks are happening. Alright. I'm I'm okay with that. That was like his worst creature because it was giving counters. And we just don't want that. None of that. Um, so now I just like play out things probably so I can do my rogues passage later. Yeah. No, that's not... A t oh, oh, we could just attack with it. Yeah, let's do that. I forgot it. The haste thing works here. 
<clears throat> All right, longest games ever. Weirdest deck ever. I'm playing like kind of a mirror. He's, his defenders make more sense though. Axbane Guardian and Trestle Trolls and whatnot, but. Like I said, my defenders hurt you. It's a good thing. Alright, I'm a little scared about this. Actually don't want auto yield probably. <sighs> He's scaring me. So what, three turns? Oh. Oh, non-creature permanent. That's pretty harsh. There goes the rogue's passage. Man. All right. And then he gets a forest. Yeah. Bummer. And a 6-8 is kind of scary. Like, very scary. Hmm. Alright. We need our... I don't know what we need anymore. <laughs> yeah, that guy would be good, probably. Oh, I didn't want him. Damn it. Uh, yeah, let's play this. This dude... It's just harsh. Uh, six eight is gonna beat me down pretty fast. I don't know. Maybe I should be conceding here, but I guess maybe there's something I could draw. And extort is a lovely thing. For the love of God, remember my uh, deal one damage though. Ooh. Man, all right. He he really turned this game around. Um, do I throw that guy under the bus? Not yet. I'll take one hit, but that's probably about all I can take off that. Six eight reach is pretty harsh. Guess I'm hoping for my other extort dude. Ooh. Or for first strike haster. Not gonna quite do it though because we don't have uh because he's got the hover barrier, quite frankly. And then we extort once. Don't know if I really want to show him that though, so in the interest of not showing him. Is he countering this? Seriously? <sighs> oh, he's got enough mana to do the, uh, to do his ability. All right, go for it, dude. I guess that's kind of good here, because every little bit of damage counts. Always yield. Thank you very much. Ah, oh, the other hired torture. That's a bummer. Not that I think you would last, but... Alright, so we're jumping now. Officially into chump mode.
bring him down to 7. And us up to 10. That's as good as we got right now. We really need the Kingpin's pet to come. <sighs> I don't like this. Oh, wow. So look what we draw. Luminate Primordial. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, my gosh. We need one more. We need to get that online. We need to get that online. Ah, if only they didn't destroy our other land. So we are just extorting. All right, next turn, draw land. That's all I've got to say. And what is it? Oh, his, his ability. Is he really milling me now? Yeah. Ten Street Market kind of would have been good, actually. Get some card drawing going. Oh, it, it, no, it would have been a mountain next. Dang it, why did he do that? Oh, well. Really? Does he have a trick? Huh. I will just block there and take three. I feel like I should do something on my end step. Ah, oh, it's a tap land. Well, it's okay because we can still play this. Start once and next turn we've got that online. I don't even know if that's enough anymore because we still need to actually do the last, you know, whatever, seven points of damage. What is he doing? Fine. We are like down to the wire in time on everything. Just let me do my night of obligation extort for the love of God. Three, three, first striker or a four? Yeah, we'll unleash her. This is down to the wire, honestly. So we do that. No, we we got to do a lot more damage to him because he's gonna gain a life. No, six life. Jeez, so he'll be at 13. But then we could start attacking with everybody? Maybe not. Ugh. So I have to block the Rhino this time. So you are getting thrown under the bus, and you. And we'll see if he has a trick. Oh, lordy. Nope, he's doing his guild mage thing. Oh, yeah, 
because I will have a card put into my graveyard too, or one card, yeah, one card. <sighs> Jeez, why can't I just yield to that? All right. All right. All the mana in the world. My 4-7 can block him all day. Do I destroy the guild mage? I think I have to destroy the guild mage. Because that's the thing that's actually killing me. Unfortunately. Um, alright. I probably shouldn't have unleashed her. I don't know what I was thinking. Because, uh, we just need extra blockers, possibly. If he's got any pump, if he's got anything. <laughs> Pretty scary. Hmm. I guess the only hope is playing fast in the next game. Because he's playing pretty slow right now. Okay, well he's got me here. I guess we'll make him go through it though. All right. We just going. All right, we're just going, I guess. 